Diana with St. Luke Kids Corner. We're so glad you joined us. This week, we're going to talk about how freedom means that we're free to serve each other in love. We know that Jesus' way is always the easier way. I have an announcement to make. Kids Corner is moving. We're moving to Sunday mornings at 10 a.m. So starting July 12th at 10 a.m., you could join us live before the 1030 live service with Pastor Kurt at St. Luke. If you miss us during the live times, that's fine. You can join us anytime after that and get all our activities and our lessons. Um, you can find us at stlukelincoln.org or just look up our Facebook page and find us on there. Here's another reminder. We are going to have Vacation Bible School. I'm so excited. August 3rd through 5th, we're going to have online Vacation Bible School, and we will have craft packets each of those days from 5 to 7 to pick up. So make sure you register, and that way we can make sure everybody has a craft packet. I have a scavenger list for this week. We have number one, a gold scarf. Hmm, where could that be? Number two, blueberries. Number three, Kool Aid packet. Number four, red, blue, yellow, and green paint. And number five, paint brushes. And our question. Our bonus question is, whose way of life is the easiest? And I've already answered it. I've already answered it in the beginning of this. So hopefully you're paying attention. <laughs> Next, we'll sing one of our favorite songs. Our God is an awesome God. You ready to make a pie? Yeah, we're getting ready to celebrate the 4th of July. It's also called Independence Day. Let's make a yummy dessert that you could make for when you celebrate. We celebrate the freedom of our country on this holiday. In Galatians chapter 5, 13, it says, For you have been called to live in freedom, my brothers and sisters, but don't use your freedom to satisfy your sinful nature. Instead, use your freedom to serve one another in love. Living in freedom doesn't mean that we're going that we're free to do whatever we feel like. It means that we're free to serve each other in love. That's how we make our country, this world, a better place for us all to live in. Now we're going to make freedom pie, okay? Okay, and for this, we need a packet of cherry Kool-Aid. And then we'll put in condensed, sweetened condensed milk. I really got to play though. And then we'll fold in the Cool Whip. And those three ingredients are the main part of the pie. And then we pour it all into a graham cracker crust. Mm -hmm. So Macy and I are going to get started here, okay? Okay. Okay, Macy poured in the Kool-Aid packet, and now she's going to pour in the sweetened condensed milk. And it's very, very gooey, isn't it? Mm -hmm. Is it so gooey? Mm -hmm. Okay, we're going to mix that up, okay? Okay, Macy's got those two ingredients mixed up. Now she is going to put ah. in the Cool Whip. Ah. <laughs> now... This is called folding it in. Oh, and by the way, make sure you wash your hands before you even start. And if you, if you um, accidentally lick your fingers like Macy just did, you gotta hurry up and go wash your hands again. 
Okay, so you just fold it in like you're folding a blanket. You do that, Macy? So we're gonna fold in the Cool Whip now. Okay, Macy and I folded in the Cool Whip into the Kool-Aid condensed milk mixture. And now we're gonna put it into the pie shell. Okay, we got it all smoothed out in there, didn't we, Macy? Yeah, now we're gonna add the spray Cool Whip. There's our stripes. I was lying down in there. Whoops, that was a weak one. There we go. Now we can decorate it with blueberries. Well, you can rewrite the dots. <laughs> okay. So. Just, we don't need a whole lot of blueberries. Just enough to make it look red, white, and blue. Although it's kind of pink, isn't it? Mm -hmm. But it's cherry. Yeah. So we'll count cherry is red. <laughs> yeah, they were red. Cherry's red, yeah. It is that pink. Is that good? It's pink. It's pink. All right. There we go. There's our freedom pie, and you can just decorate it however you want to. Right? Good job, Macy. Thank you for joining us. Bye. Bye. Now we got to eat. Hey guys, holiday weekends are fun, aren't they? Yeah. It's a chance to celebrate with your friends and your family, and it's an opportunity to rest. Because sometimes we get so busy we forget to rest, don't we? Mm -hmm. In Matthew chapter 11, verse 28 through 30, it says, Come to me, all of you who are struggling hard and carrying heavy loads, and I will give you rest. Put on my yoke and learn from me. I am gentle and humble, and you will find rest for yourselves. My yoke is easy to bear, and my burden is light. So, even though we're to spread Jesus' message, not everyone will want to hear it, will they? No. Not everyone. Still, we need to remember that Jesus' message is the best message for us, and we can rest easy in that. So let's have some fun. I know painting is very relaxing for me. Do you think that's relaxing, you guys? Mm -hmm. yeah. And what better canvas than our driveway? We can go all over, huh? Yep. Yeah. It's a little noisy from the traffic, but <laughs> that's okay. We're gonna have a beautiful driveway for them to enjoy. This sidewalk paint is very easy to make and only needs three ingredients. Use equal parts water and cornstarch and a few drops of food coloring. That's it. It was so easy to make. And look, they're using it up. <laughs> Aren't ya? Yeah, we're gonna have the most beautiful driveway on the block. And we're trying to we were trying to make some fireworks. We cut up a paper tube. Oh, Ruben's got one right there. We cut up this paper tube. Some of them worked, some of them didn't. Some of them just kind of flopped around. <laughs> I don't know my paintbrush. Yeah, we got paintbrushes, the good old paintbrushes, but we can use bottle brushes. Show them the mixer brush you have there, Ollie. The, that's our scrubber brush. That works. Just use your imagination. You could use a fly swatter and make splattery fly swatter pictures, huh? I've seen some people do pictures and they can lay down and they can be in the scene and they take a picture of it. We should try that later, huh? Yeah. Yeah, yeah you're making fireworks. We're going to see fireworks this weekend, aren't we? Hey guys, can we just take a quick break and pray? 
Ready? Macy, can you fold your hands? There we go. Good job. Dear Heavenly Father, thank you for giving us these opportunities to rest and enjoy your world you created. Thank you for the love we share in our lives and the wonderful people around us. Please forgive us when we get caught up in our lives and stray from your path. Now let us pray together the prayer we were taught. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. Lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom, the power, and the glory forever. Amen. Hey, good job. Macy, did you know your nose is green? Did you know you have a green nose? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Well, this is fun and it was so easy to do. Oh, are you feeling in my fireworks? It dries really cool. Whoops, the paper plates aren't staying down. It's kind of windy today. Well, thank you for joining us. We're just going to see if we can fill up our whole driveway full of cool murals. Think we can do that, guys? Maybe. Yeah. Maybe Looks like Oliver made gray over there. Dang it. Dang it. <laughs> no, it's a cool color. You made your own color. That's fine. Okay. All right. Thank you for joining us. It's a rainbow. <laughs> I'm making a rainbow. Yeah. Okay. Goodbye. So now we'll sing with for a prayer. Whisper a prayer in the morning, whisper a prayer at noon, whisper a prayer in the evening to keep our hearts in tune. Who answers? God answers prayers in the morning, God answers prayers at noon. Thank you for joining us. We hope to see you on Sunday, July 12th for our next Kids Corner for live chat. And always remember, God loves you and so do we.